You're all doomed. Doomed. You're all gonna die, dude. Oh my god. Interesting. I'll take that under advisement. You guys need to run. You're gonna die, dude. But you don't have to go, dude. What are we supposed to do when this dumbass wakes up? Wait. She kidnapped him too? What are you thinking to be? She kidnapped... I forgot his name. P.S.Y.S. something? Oh my god. Why could she? How could she do something like that? Wait, I'm gonna go inside the alien ship? For what? I'm gonna get trapped in here, dude. Can mag. Proof! She's a Lollafell! Oh my god! Square! Circle, Starflake, Square, X, Starflake. Why do you keep saying Starflake? Snowflake, Triangle, Circle. What? Hanog, it's you, isn't it? Bro, did you not just hear her speak a bunch of shapes, dude? What the fuck? What's up guys, welcome back to another day doing the darkness quest line. Last time we did the puppets bunker and man, that raid was interesting. We fought Decepticons left and right, constant fighting robot machines. But in the end, it was a giant twist. There was a ball of used sex dolls, dude. It was disgusting, dude. They looked so sticky. It was oh man. It was uh, uh. And then and then the ball transformed. It went into a giant sex doll fighting 2P pretty much. It looked just like 2P, but giant. It was disgusting. But we got our ass down, dash right. So now we're gonna be working towards the final raid of which I'm very excited. This story is very interesting. And people told me that there's a chance that this is possibly related to Endwalker. So I'm, I'm very interested, very curious to see what happens, guys. So without further ado, let us just jump straight in. Here we did. Kanaga. What's up, dude? I'm back. Is he okay? Come to think of it, none of us ever did get the chance to enjoy the carnival. Me neither, dude. It's so sad. I wanted to go, dude. It's possible everyone is still carrying on with it. I've never known a few explosions to dampen their spirits before. Still, I might go and check on them. Yeah, right, dude. Coming, Anog? Come on, Anog. Fine. What? Sound like a, a gate close or door close. What's all that noise? I don't know. Let's go check it out, dude. I suppose there's only one way to find out. Yeah, let's go, dude. Why are we still standing here, dude? Halt. Who goes there? What is this? What's going on here? Kanag, what's this? Please calm down. It's a complicated situation. And even we are not fully... We ain't here for your excuses. Just admit it. This is all your fault. Bro, chill, dude. What's his fault? You let things in through the tunnels. They knew you. And they got the, and look at what they did to the place. Nah, bro. It's not... Nah, bro. It's not that bad, dude. We don't care about the whys and wherefores. We want to know how you plan to make amends. Okay, well, uh, uh, well, what are you gonna do? We'll do everything we can, I swear, but... But? But what? <sighs> I don't think this is going anywhere good. The village is still in danger. No one wants to hear from me, though. Please, can you speak to Elder Glag and make him understand? You want me to make him understand? You want me to make him understand? I can do that, dude. 
Uh, I'll make him understand, all right? Hey! Hey, you! You better listen here, chap. And who might you be? Haven't seen your face around here before, or have I? I misplaced my spectacles some time ago. I almost said testicles. No matter. I'm here to investigate, not conversate. As the eldest elder, it falls to determine the truth of the rumors surrounding the disaster. The problem being, of course, that everyone here is stubborn as a diamond ingot. They all insist they know what's true, though you can be sure half of them are up to their eyeballs and ale at any given time. Yeah, because this, this is, there are a bunch of alcoholics, dude. I'm the only Lala that doesn't drink, that's right. I need a second opinion, a sober opinion. Here, let me smell your breath. Kind of weird, dude. Probably smells like Chick-fil-A, dude. You'll do. Speak with the villagers and think well on who is the right of it. Then I'll hear what you have to say. Okay. You hear that? You hear that? Your lives fall into the palm of my hand. I make the decision. Lolly, I knew it. We'd end up here someday. It's hard to know where the place to blame. I understand why you followed along the Anarch plan, but if you had all been just a little more careful, what? Blaming it on us, bitch? You, 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 you're the collaborator. Well, don't think you can come crying to me now that it's all gone wrong. It's plain as day that Anag is the type to charge ahead without a care for who she might be getting mixed up in her troubles. And her brother ain't much better. Seems like everybody hates him. Anag could have saved us from those things. I just know it. There ain't no way a clever girl like her would have found a way to fight him. If only that brother of hers weren't always holding you back. Bro! Wait! You're that outsider, right? ain't you? Maybe. Why? Don't worry, I don't blame you. I can see you're the sort one knows how to take control of the situation. I'm sure you supported Anog as best you could. Why does everybody... Why does everybody hate him? You want to know what I think? We're doomed! Doomed! Okay, thanks for your input. I didn't do it. Oh, Anog and Kanog, you say? Yes, they did do it. It was them. And you. I heard you followed Anog into the machine graveyard. Heard it with my own two ears. I did. Everyone knows it too, so you better be prepared to pay. What? No shot. This one's sus. This one, this, the demanding dwarf is very sus. This would be Anog's fault, you hear? The girl never had an ounce of prudence. If only she were more like her brother. She ought to have let that machine graveyard well enough alone, but she insisted on barging, by barging in anyway. He lists all of danger. That's what happened. Mark my words. And Anog had better answer for it. Oh, uh, dude. Well, uh, good news. They hate everybody here. They hate, they hate the both of them. So the fool still can't agree on which way is up. Wish I was surprised. Let's try to put it to a vote, eh? Maybe the ones pretending to know more about the matter than they really do will think twice about making asses on themselves so publicly. Maybe. I doubt it. Nah, they, they're, nah, they're, they're, gonna, they're gonna do, they're gonna make asses of themselves publicly, proudly. That's right. Well, well, let's start the vote. Who's the winner? Can't none of you stitch your beards for half a moment? I'm asking you to raise your hands in an orderly fashion. Yeah, that's right. That's all you gotta do. This is hopeless. We're not getting anything useful from them. Well, then threaten them. I'm not ruling out that one of these idiots accidentally has the right of it. But in your sober judgment, who's to blame? What? If you still ain't sure, you can try talking to everyone again. Though I can't say I recommend it. Just make sure you don't take any detours past the ale cask until this until this is settled. I have to choose. Still passively sober, I see. Have you come to a conclusion? Um. You're all doomed. Doomed. You're all gonna die, dude. Oh my god. Interesting. I'll take that under advisement. You guys need to run. You're gonna die, dude.
Uh -oh. Everyone, I step before you to present my findings regarding culpability in the destruction that has befallen our village. What? Please wait, it's me- Shut up. Oh, hello, this is 2B, right? Or 2P? 2, 2B, I think, right? Yes. As I've said, blaming yourselves is pointless. This is my doing. Wow. Wait a minute. Is she gonna, is she gonna start killing all of them? It's one of them. Run, run, for your lives. No, no, it's okay, dude. Okay, that works too, I guess. Are you defending us? There's no benefit to petty arguments. Oh, wow, dude, she's our hero, dude. W wait, he couldn't even say thank you. She says that, but I think it was kind of her to intervene. I think so too. It was very, that was very poggers, very pog champ thing for her to do that's right i'm sure she wants to check on her friend that other android 9s i'm going to go and talk to her okay good luck wait do i have to go do i have to go chase his ass down why'd you run away then we could have gone together dude well he's still laying down i appreciate you stepping in but i don't want everyone to see you as the enemy if you go and talk to them now, we can explain. That's not necessary. I'm leaving anyway. This is not over for us or the machines. She's leaving, dude. But you don't have to go, dude. What are we supposed to do when this dumbass wakes up? Wait! She kidnapped him too? What are you thinking to be? She kidnapped. I forgot his name. PSYS something. Oh my god. Why could she? How could she do something like that, dude? Oh, wait. 9S. I think it is what it is. I'm worried about Anong as well. She hasn't been herself since what? Well, since, since well, what? If she's not here, she's probably drowning herself from work. Come on. We should check on her. Okay. She's drowning herself in her work. That's not good. You see her, dude? She's not here. What is she doing? This isn't the time to be outside alone. We need to find her. I'll look around the village, but can you search for the outskirts? Oh, a nog. Okay, dude. So we're playing hide and go seek, dude. I have the hide and go seek champion back to back two time. Blockbuster. Ooh. Ooh. I damn near ran the wrong direction. Thank Jeebs, I stopped myself. I was like, wait a minute. This place don't look right. But my fingies were like, no, no, it's fine. But my brain kept saying, no, dude. Nah, dude, something ain't right. And you know what? Turned out my brain was right and my fingies was wrong, dude. Who would have thought? Okay. I don't see any Anog feet prints. I don't, I don't smell an Anog and I don't see eggnog. You see no sign of your despondent dwarven friend. Perhaps she has wandered further afield. Well, let's see. Detective Ock is on the case. Anag? Agnog! Where are you? Please! Please! Show yourself now! You see no sign of the spawn of Dwarven. Fuck! Agnog! Please! Please! Stop! Stop! You suck. 
You are unbelievable, you know that? You know that, you son of a bitch? I was in the middle of doing something. I have priorities. We need to find eggnog. We have searched all of the likely places. Eggnog is not to be found. Perhaps Kanog has some additional ideas, dude. Oh my god. All that work for her not to be found, dude. Oh, that kind of bullshit. Kanog. I didn't find her, dude. I tried. Anog isn't with you. No, dude. Did you not just hear me, dude? No, she's not with me, dude. I couldn't find her. What do I do? This is all because of us. And I... I, I don't know how to find her. Oh my god, dude. You should have installed a tracking device, dude. Damn, damn. What's, why are you why are they freaking out? Why are they, why are they freaking out? I'm not used to being alone. Aw. Aw, that's so sad. <laughs> it's okay, Kanak. We'll find her then. We'll find her, we'll find her, and you won't be alone. Here to see me? I appreciate it, but... I'm afraid I don't have much to tell you. There's still no sign of a nog, and the villagers are... Well, you know how they are. Can't blame them, really. TP uses us. She said as much, but we were the ones who allowed ourselves to be manipulated. I keep thinking about what we might have done differently. You can't change what you have done, but you can change what you can do now, dude. That is so true, dude. You're right. I have to fix this, somehow, or at least try. What are you lazing about here for, Kanog? Where's Anog? What? She's still up to no good, I bet, and ran off before we can make her own up to it. Don't be ridiculous. Anog, she's... She's what? Hey, you better relax, homeboy. Go on, explain to us where exactly Anog is. So that's the husband. That's Anog's husband, dude? Oh man. He's about to get his ass beat, dude. You better give us some answers, big guy. I... Be because I tell you, where my wife is, she's at death's door because of the injuries she suffered in the attack. Oh wait, that's not a dog's husband. Even if she wakes, she may never make a full recovery. Oh. That's so sad. So if you know what's good for you, you'll get out of the village before I do something we will both regret. But he has to go that way. And you also are going that way. So how is he gonna... Oh, there, he's gonna beat his ass when he uh, when he walks out of the cages. Look at that, he's gonna get jumped. There's three guards together, dude. He's gonna straight up get jumped. Now, now, Kanog. Now, now, it's okay. <laughs> Kanog seems in dire need of comfort. I just gave you comfort. You want more, dude? Bro, it's time to man up, bitch. Now, now, it's okay, young chap. You're just having a bad day, it's all, it's okay. <clears throat> Sorry, I really shouldn't be wallowing. Not wallowing. I wish I could do something to help, for that man and his wife especially. But I don't know either of them. Well, I doubt anyone is willing to talk to me now. Aw, oh, 
I'm doing. No, it's okay, bro. All you need to do is apologize. See, I'll see what I can do, but you owe me. Double. If anyone punches in the, in the face. No, no, no. Let's make it triple. If anybody punches in the face. And then I can walk around and try and force people to punch me in the face. Mm -hmm. That would be a beautiful business. Really? Thank you. Oh, no, no. It's my uh, pleasure. With a bit of luck, they'll open up to you. If there's anything I could do to make things better, anything at all, give me all of your gill. Just, just all of your gill. In the meantime, I found another way to make myself useful. It's not as if there's a shortage of rubble that needs clearing around here. True. Okay, well, uh, good luck, I guess. Hey guys, hey, I'm back. Hello. Look who it is. I hope you're not up to more mischief with the Nog and Kanog. Oh no, those guys, dude? Nah, dude, I would never, dude. I would, nah, bro. I, I don't hang out with them anymore, dude. The woman with severe injuries with an angry husband. Yes, I know who you mean. I doubt there's much to be done, but I won't stop you from trying. Those two have always been inseparable. I don't think I've ever seen him not holding hands. Can't imagine how he's feeling now that she's in such a state. Why can't I just go in there and heal him, dude? Like, I'm a healer, dude. Look at me, dude. You're friends with the poor deals, aren't you? The very best of friends. And how long have those days we drank away without a care in the world? She always loved the mead. We all did. It was good mead. This is so sad. That it was. There, there. Oh, man. It was so sad. And the music is not helping. Kanog, I spoke to them, dude. They're going to murder you, bro. You gotta run. They talked to you? And no one got violent? No, dude. They just, they were all wearing, like, pitchforks. Or they all had pitchforks and, like, flaming torches and shit. And like knives and daggers and swords and stuff. They're gonna come to kill you, bro. You need to, you need to get out of here, bro. Mead? I suppose we are dwarves. So maybe it's not such a terrible idea. Uh, but as far as I know, none of our stores survived the attack. Damn, bro. So they need to, they need to connect. They need, they need a street alcohol pharmacist store. We could buy more and still a tide. That's right. Unless you are broke, bitch. Oh, there is some available for purchase. I'd have happily spent the coin. Can you show me the way? It's that way. Okay, I can go myself or it's too dangerous for you out there. So either way, I'm going to be the delivery boy. Wow. No. no, no, I insist. I've accompanied you to much more dangerous places before. And I assure you, I won't be burdened. And... I need to do this. Really, dude? You're gonna go instead of me, dude? Oh, I take it back. Wow, you're such a nice guy, dude. I still have a few things to tie the away before I leave, so I'll meet you at the bridge in a bit. Okay. Wait, how the fuck did you tidy everything up? And then meet me at the bridge before I even got to the bridge. What? There you are. Now, if you'll show me the way. Yeah, you just keep following the road. Ah, the ladder. I've never used it before. This will be an adventure. Okay. This is going to be an adventure indeed. But you're gonna walk through the desert and I'm gonna fuck also walk because I thought that was a teleport. Guess not. Okay, Kanog, I'm here now, dude. I, I guess I had to walk to the desert. The view is different outside the village. Maybe I can find the perspective I need. Bro, pick a spot, and then I'll run to I'll run to that spot. Stops making me stop halfway. I swear, if he ends up at the city, and, and I could have just teleported there from the beginning, we're gonna have problems. Oh no, they're ganging up on the striker, dude. They're going gang gang, dude. I have to defend. I must protect. Wow. 
There, it is. there you go, big guy. Wait, wait, this is the fates? Oh, fuck you. I was just trying to be. I don't care about no damn fate, bro. I just thought you were getting ganked on, dude. So I just came to help. Sorry, Kanaga. I got I got held up with something. Sorry, I'm here now. It's massive. How in the world did you get this movie? That's what she said. With a great deal of help. That's right. Many people had to help me move it. Mm -hmm. It's so damn big. That's right. Well, go on. Tell me all about it. Well, we had one person controlling the base. Okay. And then we had a few other people working together to control the actual giant shaft of the project. I had no idea all of this happened to you more. And the Talos, marvelous. Yep, yep. I wish I had your ability to bring out the best of people. Maybe then Calmer wouldn't be. No, nope. you'd still fuck it up and Calmer would still be the way it is. Never mind. I thank you for your enlightening tale. And now we descend. Oh my God, we're actually walking over there together dude it should have let me teleport it dude come on big fella come on far be it for me to complain after having insisted upon accompanying you but are we there yet no unfortunately we are not there yet eastward it is then yes vamanos come on wow crazy that was a long walk wasn't it deep press canog just act natural confident you can do this. Ah! Okay, he had to he had to pump himself up, dude. That's right. Excuse me, Octavian. Good to see you. Hello. Who's your friend? He seems eager. Holy ho! I would like some meat, please, ma'am. Wait. She needs to ID him, doesn't she? Well, I can't say no to the one who asked so nicely. And any friend of Alcavian is welcome here. I'll bring out our finest. She's not gonna ID him, dude? He's like three inches tall, dude. Did you see? I did it. Uh, I feel so good to be working toward a goal again. True. Here we are. This is my homemade pee. Thank you, ma'am. I think there should be sufficient payment. Let's hurry back. As exhilarating as the adventure has been, I want to make a gift of me right away. Okay. Well, it was good. It was good to see you again. Bye. Would you like to come with me? When I deliver the meat, I mean. Okay. Uh... Well, I guess I don't really have a choice. Of course I will. I would love to go with you to deliver this bean, dude. It's gonna be incredible. I appreciate it. I admit that I'm a bit nervous, but this is my chance to help, if only in a small way. So I have to take it. Okay, dude. All right, well, you ready, bro? Are you ready to make amends? Excuse us. Well, um, we wanted to offer our best wishes and my sincere apology as well. Are they gonna accept it? Open the door, dude. I know it doesn't come close to making up for what you've been through, but I brought you this. I thought that maybe you could share it later. Bro, come on. Go away. We don't want anything from you. <laughs> He's just tried to say sorry. All I want is for you to sort off so that me and my wife never have to see you again. Oh my god. I'm sorry. Oh no. Look what you did, you dumbass husband. 
You know what? I'm saying it. Your wife deserved it. That's right. She deserved it. Kunog sounds to be in a considerable distress. You had best follow him lest it come to harm. Now look what I have to go do, dude. Because of your dumbass. Now I gotta go run behind him and make sure he's A-OK. -okay. The mead bottle. Did he drink it on the way down, bro? He chugged the whole thing before he got down to here? The bottle of mead that Kunog had earnestly wished would cheer the unfortunate couple now lies forlorn. Interesting. Lolly, we've got another situation in our beards, ho. Hello, chap. Kunog just ran right past me toward the crater. I don't know about you, but I'd really rather not have him be there by himself, especially not when he's so upset. I could hear the sobs from yobs away. Oh no, he's crying like a bitch, dude. It's so sad. What's that all about? The villagers still blame him for all of it, dude. Actually, fuck it. We're gonna go with... So there's this injured woman, right? Right? And then, and then and there's this, like, there's, like, one, like, mad, angry husband, dude, right? And he's being a bitch bad at it. That's right. It's a tragic state of affairs all around. The man you met, his wife was a child before her injury. Can't blame him for lashing out, given the circumstances. She was pregnant, dude! But that doesn't mean Kanak deserves to take the brunt of it all. I'd consider it a personal favor if you'd find if you find him and tell him so. Another personal favor, at any rate. He's not the most athletic dwarf I've ever met, so with any luck, he won't have gotten to fall while we've been talking. I'll go and have a word with certain folks in the village. See if we can repair some of the damage that's been done. Okay. All right. Well, uh, we will. I guess we'll both try our best. No promises. Kanag. Kanag, where are you, dude? Kanag. Come back. Find no sign of the dwarf you seek. A state of affairs that you are becoming all too familiar with. All right, I'm back to the to the badass game room, dude. Kanaga, you still to see so much as a wisp of beard disappear disappearing around the corner. Kanag must be further down. Where, dude? Wait, I'm gonna go inside the alien ship. For what? I'm gonna get trapped in here, dude. Kanag. Oh no. Passage to the bridge. Oh god. The giant fucking door. Kanag? What happened? What do I see? Can I? Oh my god. Oh my god. They recycled the sex dolls and that's all the semen that was left from the giant ball of sex dolls, dude. I told you, bro. It was super sticky, dude. That's incredible, dude. Nothing but semen, that thing is. Oh my god. Uh... A dog? What? No, that's not eggnog, dude. That's a ball of semen, you dummy. How does that look like an og? What are you trying to say? A dog! Look over here! A dog? Don't run off, Kanog. It's dangerous. Let your big sister take the lead. Kovu, stop! Stop, Kovu! I need to see! Don't make me pull an alinity! 
That's what I thought. Lay down. Whoa! Wicked White! Kanog! Move! Oh no! Oh no! The Cumball Cruster, dude! That's so sad! It's okay, bro. It's okay, bro. Just rise. You're fine. Oh my god. Oh my god! Is that her? Is that her hands? Anog! Kanog! Are you down there? I'm coming! Are those her hands or those gloves? Damn, that shit left a giant crater, dude. Holy fuck. Kunog, answer me! Oh no! Her hat! No! Is she dead, dude? There's no shot. There's no shot. A nag. A nag. What the fuck was that? Is she playing a prank on us, dude? Oh my god, the fuck is that? Did she just evolve? It's the ball of semen! Uh, Anag? Are you behind this thing? Okay, so she's not underneath the ball of semen. Anag, please, say something. Say something, I'm giving up on you. Say circle, snowflake, X square, number sign, square, sack, circle. What? What, what? what kind of language was that? Okay, well, he's still alive. Anaga! Proof! She's a Lalafell! Oh my god! Square! Circle, star flake, square, X, star flake. Why don't you say star flake? Snowflake, triangle, circle. What? Hanog, it's you, isn't it? Bro, did you not just hear her speak a bunch of shapes, dude? What the fuck? K nog K Konog Oh my god She turned to a robot So is this how androids are made? Wait, so there's another ball of semen on the ship. Or is it the same ball of semen? That thing from the Yorb can't be a nog. I'm sorry. Yeah, but there's no shat. There's no shat. How do you know? How did you even know about that back when she... Back when she what, dude? Never mind. 
It doesn't matter. A nog is what matters. A nog. She. Oh, dude. Oh, dude. Why is it so sad? Stop, dude. Let's go home and take some time to think, all right? All right, bud. Come on. Come on, bud. It's okay. Come on. Come on, chap. Fun. Hey. Kanag? Oh, he's sitting in the corner, dude. Da -da -da. Sorry, I'm fine. Everything's fine. Oh, man. Bro, this guy is gonna break my heart, dude. Alright, Chief. Hefe, boss man. Tell me you found him. Uh, uh, technically, uh, we found them. You know. What's the matter? She's dead, dude. She's dead. <laughs> I think she got crushed by a ball of semen. She fell from a cliff, you say? And then she disappeared? And when she reappeared from this orb, there wasn't a scratch on her? Oh yeah, that too. Yeah, bro. She Yeah, bro. She got turned into a, she got turned into an android. I admit that sounds bad, but I found those two in these very tunnels myself years ago. Wait, you found these two dwarves in the tunnel years ago? What? They were a pair of troublemakers since the start, and they've always been a little strange, to be sure. They have good hearts, though, both of them. Anong's too headstrong to let a little tumble, uh, tumble keep her down, and I'm certain she'll be back with us before you know it. As for the orb, I haven't the slightest idea, so don't you go prodding it, and keep it quiet for now. We may not be able to keep Kanog from dashing off again later, but we can preserve the peace for now. Okay. So, is Eggnog and Kanog possibly androids, dude? I am so confused. Lolly, I may have been too optimistic, Octavian. The fact that the villagers are still nursing a grudge doesn't surprise me. Not that I haven't tried to make them think better of it, but why hasn't a nod come back and given them what for yet? It ain't like a fret over what people think. There's something wrong, dude. Then there's Kanog. I was worried he'd go chasing after her again, which is why I'm even more worried that he's been shut up in the tunnels this whole time. It's gonna be okay, dude. He'll be fine. Chief! Yes? We need to clear the rubble so that we can start digging again, but the others will stop bickering about whose job it is. Not even when I threaten to boot them clear into the sea. Yeah, cause you're, cause you're a pussy and you wouldn't actually do it. So that's why they don't care. I'll be right there. Two boots are better than one, as they say. Well, technically, he's got two boots already. So you also have two boots. So that would be four boots, you silly goose. Looks like I have other business to, to take care of. Not that I was having much luck here. Can you check on Kanog in my stead? Sure. What with a knock on and the villagers treating him like he's got the blight, he could do with the reminder that not everyone has abandoned him. And who's to say? Maybe one of your tales of adventurers will cheer him up. Okay, or Scarhorn for life. That's a that's also that that's also a pretty big possibility. I'm sure whatever you come up with will be fine, probably. Okay, and let me know if he's doing all right. Even if he doesn't want to talk to me, I I want him to have the help he needs. Is all. Wow, dude, what a nice guy, dude. Wow. Kanag, are you okay, dude? Is he dead? Kanaga is radiating an uncommon amount of heat. The many layers insul insulating his head probably aren't helping. Wait, I can't undress him, dude! That's who they are, dude. 
How did, how, did, how did they ever take off the armor? He's got red hair? What? What? I never expected that. Kanag? Are you okay, Kanag? What? You collapsed is what? You need rest. Don't you move, you dummy. Keep your ass down. No, I'm fine. Got to find Anog. Bro, Anog's dead, you dummy. No, you're not going anywhere, dude. Bro, she's fucking... She's gone, dude. It's time to move on, bro. That's it. You're an only child now. Anog. Anog. I'm... I don't know how many times I said I'm so sad in the past hour, dude, but it's so sad. Hey, chief, boss man, there's a problem. Kanog's being, uh, yeah, yeah he, he, he passed out. He collapsed? Yep, he passed out. We need to do something about that fever. I think some of my wife's supply of remedy survived. I'll go and see. You keep an eye on Kanog. Okay. I will babysit Kanog. The baby will babysit. Does this make shit bad for me? Wicked White! Where did he go? Oh, wait a minute. This is- this was the bed for Kanog? He's gone! I know he wanted to search for Kanog. But how did he even make it out of here? He's a god! We'll worry about that later. Damn it all! Let's go, quickly! Oh god. What did you do, Kanog? He's dead. He's gonna die. To be. Okay, and that's... That's, that's SP? Or 2P? No. Who's there? 9S, that's what it is. Yes. You! Who? You who? Who'd you say to be? We should ask around. Find out if anyone saw him go past. Not that I expect they'll be too inclined to help. Still, any lead is better than none at all. I'll speak with my miners. You talk to whoever else. Okay, I will speak to whoever else you say. Hey! I need information! Now! No, I haven't seen a nog leaving the village. Why? None of your business why. I just need to know if you've seen him. Finally realized he's no good to us and left, did he? But without him or nog, who's going to be held responsible for what happened? Wow, dude, is that all you care about them for, dude? The collaborator are here, for one. Listen, outsider. I'm sure you thought you were helping, but now we're doomed. Y'all, y'all are some bullies. You know that, right? Unbelievable, dude. I can't believe they will speak to me in such ways. Now Kanog's missing too. We're dropping dwarves like ale from the leaky cask. Well, I hope you find them. The matter of the, culp of the culpability is still unsettled. And I'll never get the villagers to agree on what's what and the most guilty-looking parties up and vanish. Well, that sounds like a personal problem. Yes? Hello? Yes? It's just for Kanag who's, hey, that can't be easy. Those twins aren't really the sort to stand still. Wish I could help, but I haven't seen anything out of the ordinary. Not more than usual, at any rate. Certainly no fever idol dwarves. His wife. What's wrong with her? Are you beating your wife? Are you beating her, dude? Or is she had the illness? What's the problem? What's going on here? I'll come back and deal with you later, mister. Because right now, I have priorities. Like, waiting at the destination. Yep, yep. And here I am. Anybody out there? Lovely. I thought I'd never escape. Oh. Who knew that questioning every miner in the combo could be so time consuming? Bro, it's about time, dude. I hope you weren't waiting too long. Did you learn anything useful? Ah, uh, no. They're all pretty useless. And they all hate them. Wish I could say I was surprised. 
My lot also had some difficulty focusing on some immediate issue, but one of them did see Kanak. It sounds like he was wandering in the direction of the crater. Again, we should search the area. Okay. We will, uh, we can do our best. No promises. Like, we're gonna show up and he's gonna either be a robot himself or dead. What's the big wheel? Some kind of machine? No, bro, that's a futuristic Ferris wheel, you dummy. It's an enemy stronghold. Or, sorry, it's an enemy stronghold. Well, that doesn't sound good, though I'm still more concerned about where Kanog might have gone. I have a bad and familiar feeling about this. Yep, I think uh, something's afoot. You think he's inside? And he's probably not alone. Here we go again. I guess here we go again. But here we go again next time because guys, this is where I'm gonna call it. That's right. Uh, today we are having some issues with Kanog and Anog. I think Anog's dead. Kanog's heartbroken, he's distraught, doesn't know what to do, trying to find different ways to cope with what's going on. I feel very bad about all of this. It's very, very sad story, dude. Very, very sad. But on top of that, the chief was talking about how Kanog and Eggnog were originally found in the cave. So does this mean they themselves are aliens, dude? Who knows? But next time, we're gonna be doing the Tower of the Paradigm's Breach, or the Paradigm's Breach, and I'm very excited. So guys, if you enjoyed the video, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that bell notification so you get notified when I post future content. But guys, with all that said, I will catch you all next time on the flip side. Peace.